Yeah, my name's Dan, Dan Dovey, from Bristol uh, in the UK. I'm 35 years old. Um, I test lightning protection, so similar to an electrician. So yeah, I think when I was younger, probably mid twenties, I started to notice that I had quite thin hair. My dad's got thin hair as well. Um, so I think that's when it started. And then, yeah, as I got into, I'm in my mid thirties now. So as I got into my mid thirties, it started to get really, really bad. Um, and then, yeah, I just made the decision that I, I had a friend that actually come to Hair of Istanbul previously. Um, and he said to me that this place was amazing. And um, yeah, he just said, he said his journey coming here and everything that happened, getting his hair transplant done was amazing. So um, I decided that I wanted to make the decision to come here and, and see if uh, see what it's like basically. Yeah, massively, massively. That's one thing, that's the main reason behind why I wanted to get my hair done. Because self-esteem and, and a lot of the, the problems that come with low self-esteem and low self-worth, and having hair that, do you know what I mean, like, is not in great condition, it can affect you mentally, definitely. I found out, so basically, a, a friend of mine, who's a bit younger than me, a chap named Henry, he had a transplant done maybe two years ago, a year and a half ago. But my, a, a lad that we are friends with used to cut his hair as well. And um, basically, he said to me, he the, the best transplant he's ever seen. And so I spoke to Henry about it. He gave me the details and then, yeah, he gave me all the details and then here I am. Yeah, that was really good. That was really good. Um, it, nice, it was quick as well. A lot of the things that, since I've been here, that one was nice and straightforward and done quite quickly, so. To be honest, when they, soon as yesterday, when the transplant was done, um, no, sorry, the day before when the transplant was done, um, I got back to the room and obviously it's nice and straight. There's no like zigzags, everything's really like symmetrical. So really, really impressed with that. I think the main problem with, not the problem, but the forehead, I think towards the end when they're implanting the hair follicles themselves, that was that was slightly like irrit slightly irritating, but obviously it's something that, I've got loads of tattoos, so I'm used to, I'm used to the pain. It depends really. So I've got a tattoo on my chest and that, right on the bone there, was unbelievably painful. So I would probably say that. I mean, like, obviously you've got needles going into your head, which is quite a strange area to have needles in. Uh, but to be completely honest, it, it's got to be the tattoos for me. It's more, pain. and obviously it lasts longer, whereas with the needles, it's only a short period of time. And I feel like, thank you. Like, the whole experience has been really, really great. Yeah, just everyone here as well has been really helpful. Um, and like, yeah, you're treated like a king. If you come here, you're treated like a king. And yeah, it's been a really good experience. So thank you.